Welcome back to Brand Unveiled. Today we're stepping into the world of gaming, more specifically into the enigmatic universe of Kirby, Nintendo's cute, pink, voracious hero. But as adorable as he may seem, there are some pretty dark secrets Nintendo tried to hide about this character. Ready to have your mind blown? Then let's get into the 10 dark secrets about Kirby that Nintendo tried to hide. Fact number one, Kirby was not originally supposed to be pink. That's right, the lovable roly-poly pink puffball we all know and adore wasn't initially designed to be pink. Kirby's creator, Masahiro Sakurai, left Kirby's color undefined in his first game, Kirby's Dream Land, due to the Game Boy's monochromatic graphics. It was only in later games that Kirby adopted his signature pink hue. Fact number two, Kirby's voracious appetite is a terrifying trait. Despite his adorable looks, Kirby's most well-known ability is quite frightening if you think about it. Kirby can inhale his enemies and either spit them out or swallow them to copy their abilities. That's right, this pink puffball literally devours his enemies to harness their powers. If that's not a dark secret, we don't know what is. Fact number three, Kirby was initially a placeholder sprite. In the early stages of development of Kirby's Dream Land, Kirby was initially just a placeholder sprite. His simplistic design was just meant to serve as a stand-in until they came up with a more complex character design. But as development went on, the creators grew attached to the little blob and decided to keep him as he was. It's quite a journey from a stand-in blob to one of the iconic faces of Nintendo, isn't it? Fact number four, Kirby's game series is not always as light-hearted as it appears. At first glance, Kirby's game series seems to be a fun and carefree adventure. Who doesn't love playing as a pink, fluffy character who inhales everything in sight? However, a closer look reveals that there are some serious undertones lurking beneath the surface. Take Kirby 64 The Crystal Shards, for example, which features a world that has fallen into a post-apocalyptic state, where a once beautiful planet is now destroyed and controlled by an evil force. This sort of storyline is certainly unexpected for a game with such playful graphics. It just goes to show that looks can be deceiving, and there's more to a game than what meets the eye. Fact number five, Kirby's villain King DTD is not really a villain. Another surprising fact about the Kirby universe is that his sworn enemy, King DTD, is not actually evil. In most games, he's just misunderstood or under the control of a genuinely evil force. This adds an additional layer of complexity to Kirby's seemingly simple world. All right, we're halfway through our list and we're just getting started. But before we dive back in, don't forget to hit the like button if you're enjoying this video and subscribe to our channel, Brand Unveiled, for more jaw-dropping revelations like these. All right, let's get back to unveiling the secrets. Fact number six, the happy-go-lucky music of Kirby's adventure has a darker secret. You may have fond memories of playing Kirby's Adventure on your Nintendo as a kid, but did you ever stop to listen to the music? Specifically, the track for the level Butter Building. What may sound like a happy-go-lucky tune actually has a much darker secret. The melody is a sped-up version of the Funeral March, creating a creepy and unsettling feeling that contrasts with the game's cute pink puffball protagonist. It's an unexpected choice that adds a layer of intrigue and mystery to the game's soundtrack. Next time you fire up your old Nintendo, give the music a listen and see if you notice the chilling hidden message behind the cheery tunes. Fact number seven, Kirby's American box art versions are deliberately made more aggressive. For some strange reason, Nintendo of America decided to depict Kirby as angrier and more aggressive on the American versions of the box art for his games. This is a stark contrast to the cheerful and innocent Kirby depicted in the Japanese versions. Talk about a cultural switch up. Fact number eight, Kirby's Dream Land 2 has a grim alternate ending. Kirby's Dream Land 2 has always been known for its cheerful gameplay and upbeat storylines. However, what many players may not know is that the game actually has a surprisingly dark twist. If you manage to complete the game without collecting all the rainbow drops, Kirby and his friends are taken over by the dreaded dark matter. The once tranquil world becomes dreary and grim, ending the sour game on a somber note. This alternate ending adds a whole new layer of depth to the game, showing that not everything is always sunshine and rainbows in Kirby's world. Fact number nine, Kirby has a rather dystopian spin-off game. Kirby, the lovable pink puffball, is no stranger to saving his home planet from various villains. However, in the spin-off game, Kirby, planet Robobot, things take a darker turn. 
In this dystopian setting, Kirby's beloved pop star is under threat from an evil corporation that seeks to mechanize the entire planet. The contrast between the dystopian landscape and the otherwise happy-go-lucky Kirby universe is strikingly out of place, making Kirby Planet Robobot a unique addition to the series. As Kirby, players must navigate through levels and use new abilities to take down the corporate forces and save their planet from destruction. Will Kirby be able to restore Popstar to its former glory? Play to find out. Fact number 10. Kirby's original name was… quite bizarre. Would you believe that Kirby, the lovable pink puffball, was originally known as Twinkle Popo? It's true! Before the name Kirby was chosen, the developers of the game toyed with several other options, one of which was Twinkle Popo. Although it's unclear why they ultimately decided against this peculiar name, we can all be thankful for the change. After all, Kirby has become a beloved character not only for his adorable looks, but also his heroic actions in saving Dreamland time and time again. Well, that's a wrap on the 10 dark secrets about Kirby that Nintendo tried to hide. We hope this journey into the less known aspects of the Kirby universe has been as intriguing for you as it was for us. As cute and fluffy as Kirby might seem, there's certainly more to this character than meets the eye. We hope you enjoyed this episode of Brand Unveiled. If you did, be sure to leave a like, hit that share button, and if you haven't done so already, make sure to subscribe for more incredible deep dives into your favorite brands and franchises. Until next time, keep unveiling!